we wake. Hear the bird. Hey guys, and welcome to today's vlog. I have not vlogged in like a month, two months. I don't know. It's been a while. Um, but I just found my battery. I was actually, I lost my battery and my charger. So it's taken me like weeks to find it, even though I've like just haven't been actively looking for it. Here's Maisie Ray. Um, she uh, walks really well now. So she started walking around 10 months and just is on the move now. Maisie. Come here. Come get mommy. She doesn't have to hold on to that. Oh, her foot's stuck on something. That's why she is. What do you have? Hello. Come on. Oh, Brinkley knocked her down. So actually I just got done putting together like a Kroger order because I like to do grocery pickup. I mean, I like to go to the grocery store too to like literally just get out of the house and like let Maisie see the world because she never does. Picking it up from Kroger tomorrow. Um, I've been trying to like eat healthier, like have healthier food for Maisie around the house because she pretty much eats like all just like, you know, regular food. She doesn't really eat like baby food or anything anymore. Um, but what's wrong? What's wrong? She really likes the camera because she thinks that it's like FaceTime. She loves talking to people on FaceTime, like my parents, Nick's parents, um, Nick especially. She like loves to talk to him. So when she sees like somebody talking, like I'm talking to the camera, she literally thinks that I'm like talking to a person. Don't you? But actually what I think I'm gonna go do, I'm gonna do the dishes I need to before I leave. But I'm gonna drive around post a little bit and um, I'm gonna record um, because I wanna eventually, after, I'm sure I can't do it all in one day, but I'm gonna Fort Campbell community tour, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. But Maisie's crawling all over me. And Brinkley is in my face. I can't, guys. I'm so tired. Um, Nick is still deployed, as you guys might know. He's deployed. He deployed in July, and it's February. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I'm going to do the dishes. Hopefully, Maisie will let me. just go ahead and update you guys in this video i thought i would do like a separate you know like update video but i just don't got the time nobody i don't at least people probably do not me i went home for christmas and then i came back um the first of january so i've been home since then that's the only time i went back home to indiana and um my sister came down with me my sister and my niece they drove back with me and my dad drove um, came down here and then rode with me to Indiana and then my sister drove back. So I haven't had to do the drive alone Thankfully or wait is that the second time? No, it's the second time I went to Indiana but I've had people with me both times, which is really nice um, Maisie did really good in the car. She's um, She slept a really long time the first time and then the second time Annie kept her my niece kept her really entertained um, We got home just chilling. January was like a crazy month out of nowhere. Um, my cat got, we got home. We had left the cats, but I had my neighbor check on them and stuff. I got home and then like 
I don't know, a couple days later, I realized like my cat was like peeing blood and I was just like, well, that's new. So I called, um, I got her into the vet like the same day because it was just obviously like, really concerning. And so we got her into the vet. Um, she had a really bad UTI. So I had to drop her off at a separate vet than I normally go to. And I dropped her off in the morning and I picked her up at night because it took them all day to get a urine sample from her. She had a really bad UTI. So she was on two different medications for two weeks and it was like twice a day. I had to find this cat and grab her by her scruff and give her oral medication. So that was fun. It's also Aria who's like not the nicest cat and I got scratched so many times, but you gotta do a good deal. And then we took her back, or I took her back two weeks later and they checked and they said that her urine was fine and that she was like better. Um, and she has to be on like special cat food now, so that's great. Um, and then what else happened? Sansa got shots, um, just to like update her shots. Um, Maisie had a neurology appointment. She had um her nine month appointment she ended up getting one shot during that and it was so sad she like cried so hard and i know she's like close to she was closer to 11 months at this appointment but whatever she's still in the 99th percentile for all that stuff height weight um and her head is like always been measuring like normal like 50 percent or whatever um Yeah, she's just walking really good. And then, so the big thing that happened was we went to Nashville. My mom came down from Indiana. Um, and then Maisie had to get a one hour EEG. I was really, really anxious for that because um, just seeing your baby like hooked up to stuff, even it's like not an invasive test at all. It's just like electronic, uh, like nodes stuck to her head and then they wrap her, they call it a helmet and I'll insert pictures. Um, it's just not a good feeling also i'm just you know really scared about all the stuff um seizures you know Maisie had seizure seizures after she was born and um i'm not gonna go too far into her medical stuff um just to keep her privacy but um you guys can know about like the gist of like what happened in the NICU from our old video um my baby's NICU story and um but anyways, the EG is, it was a follow-up, which, um, to see if Maisie, <laughs> it's okay, it's to see if she's grown out of her seizures, um, because what she has is something she gr can grow out of, think thankfully, and, um, she had to stay awake for the drive there, um, Nashville's an hour away, so my mom came down, and Matt, my brother, came down, and we kept her up um, the whole drive, we got there, and they hooked her up, she did really, really well, she wasn't like fighting the guy, putting them on, and so what happened was she needed to take a nap during the EEG, because they can see the best like thing when she goes to sleep and when she wakes up, is like when they can see like seizure activity really well. Um, so that, she did nap, thankfully, I was like really scared she wasn't gonna nap, because she kind of fights her naps. She did fall asleep, thankfully. And um, they also did this like flashing light test before the EEG, which was pretty, like I didn't know they were gonna do and I was really scared um, that she was gonna have a seizure or something. And I also don't like flashing lights, so I was sitting in there like as these like flashing lights, it like starts slow and then it gets faster and faster and faster for five minutes and I was just like having a panic attack, but Maisie did really well. Um, and then we got the call back that her EEG was normal and she got to wean off of her medication. Um, she's still currently being weaned off of it, so um, she's been doing well so far, and I'm hoping that it continues to go well um, and that everything's good and she can just be off the medicine. And yeah, she's been taking that twice a day every day since she came home from the NICU, so a lot, a long time. Yeah, you happy? Um, when we were, she also has four teeth now and yeah she's just a big old girl um something else is i have started a new etsy um i'm selling like um tassel garlands 
um i will link all that stuff down below if you guys want to check it out and i'll show some pictures and stuff but it's been keeping me busy and i'm really really enjoying it um i think they're cute <laughs> Yeah. Old MacDonald had a farm. Yeah. Oh, the dogs are really good with Maisie, so like I don't have to worry about like her hurting them. She's pretty soft with them, and then the dogs are really good about like not caring if she climbs on them. So, Winkley's a good girl. Basically, we're just really missing Nick. I do have some like really big news coming in a couple months. Um, and I'm really excited to tell you guys all about that. And um, yeah, you'll just have to like subscribe if you're not subscribed to find out our big news. Um, um, is there anything else? I'm trying to think, is there anything else? It Maisie turns, oh, sorry. Maisie turns one next month and we're getting her one year pictures. Um, and I'm so, so excited for her birthday. And um, we're actually doing the pictures on her actual birthday. You're so fake. You're so fake. Yeah. She's a nut. <laughs> but that is pretty much the update i think that's it um oh a little bit more is like Maisie was sick in december she she got like a cold and then she got an ear infection that was like the first time that she's ever been sick so that was like really hard to deal with alone because i'm obviously a worry wart but she did good she's okay um an ear infection uh you know antibiotics all that good stuff so we cannot wait for next day at home we're really missing him um i'm gonna be vlogging more now that i actually found my battery and stuff so um if you guys would please check out my etsy and just like um like you can favorite my shop and like favorite my items and it really helps um like it be seen more on etsy like the more people that like it the more it shows up in people search so that mean a lot um i also have an instagram for it i'm gonna link everything down below but um i think what time is it it's like 3 30 i thought i was gonna go drive around but it gets dark here so early i don't think i am i'm just gonna like stay home and chill but i might i don't know we'll see okay so i'm making dinner now i'm making i really like this Let's see if it focus. Super greens pasta for Maisie. It has spinach, zucchini, broccoli, parsley, and kale. It's made out of that instead of like, you know, normal pasta. Um, so me and her are gonna have that. I'm making quite a lot because I would like leftovers tomorrow. And then I'm also making some green beans. And um, so that's what I'm making for dinner. I'm watching Mia Maples like her van, like movie show. I mean, not van show. It's her van Reno. Um, like it just came out the second part and I've been watching it. So if you don't watch Mia Maples, she has really good stuff. Um, yeah, I'm just watching that. Maisie Ray's just walking around. She has her movie on. And then we're gonna eat dinner and then we'll probably go to bed. Yeah, I'll show you guys like when the food's all done. It's super simple, but like I just needed that tonight. All right, well, I forgot to show you the rest of my food because i ate it so fast because i was so hungry here's Maisie. she hasn't finished eating yet but she also i usually give her more than she'll eat you want to see you do you see you yeah here show them how big of a girl you are take a big girl bite <gasps> big girl bite Yummy! Mm -hmm. Yummy! Her sleeves did get dirty. So that's nice on her white shirt. We've got stain remover though. Are you the prettiest? Oh yeah. You want another big girl bite? It's a big girl bite. We watch uh, like a movie or something while she's eating so that she'll actually eat because this girl is on the move and doesn't want to just stay still That might be bad, but like I don't know 
What are you doing? You tell me you're scared You tell me you're you think and I know it's hard yeah I know it's rough but we'll make it through and I'll back you up Alright guys, so I'm going to try not to get emotional about this because Nick would make fun of me. But I am about I'm gonna get emotional. I'm about to give Maisie her last dose of medicine. Hopefully ever. Um not medicine like in general, but her medicine for her seizures. So this is it. We've been on a tapering schedule and this is the last day, the last dose of it. <sighs> I don't know why I'm like emotional, but I'm just excited for her to not have to be on med everyday medication anymore. You're afraid. I wish you could see that. I think you're brave. ahead and end the vlog here little miss Maisie okay I know her short story guys I couldn't help it but she is done with her medicine I'm so happy she was so good about her medicine she always took it really well and um, I'm just so proud of her to be done and that everything turned out well I'm really thankful I will take it from her don't worry but I'm going to end the vlog here. If you guys liked today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And me and Maisie will see you in the next vlog. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done.